Yo, what's up YouTube? I'm back here with another video, another unboxing. Today what we're going to be unboxing is the Rigid Shot Back. Well, it's not called Shot Back, but it's Rigid HDC 0900. So I'm going to give y'all uh, some specs on this here. 4.25 peak horsepower. It's 9 gallons, uh, 34 liter. They claim that this right here is a tug along dual flex lock and holes rigid full lifetime warranty i guess uh let's go ahead and let's unbox it all right all right so this looks like this right here is the bottom base assembly and wheels and with a carrying handle we have our hose we have we have this here a wand okay it's pretty lightweight So this right here looks like it would be for maybe hmm, your floor, something like that. You have this right here. I paid $61 for this. This right here was uh, separate, as y'all just seen. That, um, yeah, I got, uh, I forget what this right here is called. Uh, if I can remember, I will throw up some annotations or whatever. But here's the information for this. All right, so uh, the reason why I'm, well, obviously I'm showing you all this here. All right, so with the $64 uh, rigid uh, vacuum, you don't get these. So I paid $61 of course, you know, I got free shipping and I didn't pay as much. So here's this right here again, just in case if you need these parts separately. Let's take a look at the shop back itself. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and we're going to open up our nice little bag here. All right, so here we have our shop back handle. All right, right here it takes two screws. Um, I just seen the two screws. There's our two screws. Then we also have here our, um, we have four. We have four of these guys right here. They go on the bottom of the shop back. We got wheels, rolling, rolling wheels. And these uh, wheels right here, they're, uh, they feel like they're made of pretty good material. Here's what uh, the wheel looks like right here. We have the manual here, the instruction manual. This right here is the brush. Man, all right, there's really soft. Yeah, we have this right here. All right, so now guys, we're gonna go ahead. We're going to um, put the wheels on this sucker and let's go ahead and <laughs> let's put the wheels on. Let's do it. All right, so uh, I'm gonna show y'all how to um, put this guy here on all right so you have this uh this guy right here you need to take and it goes right up in here all right all right so i got uh, a rubber mallet just to, uh, you know, help me out a little bit. Uh, I have inflammation in my arms and I don't need to be uh, beating on nothing. Same thing, you just wanna do that. And you're not gonna crack the plastic. I mean, as long as you're not just, you know, going super ham on it. These right here, they require no screws whatsoever. All 
time to install the wheels. Yay, we got all four wheels on. All right, so uh, I want to show y'all something. This piece here, or this piece of plastic back here, should I say, it's longer than uh, this here. This one right here, uh, this is designed a little bit different. But anyway, what you want to do is take that, and then you just do that like that, and then you uh, put in the screws. All right, so uh, there's your shot back handle. Now we're going to install the holes. This neck right here, it does um, turn or whatever. You just take that and there you have it. So now uh, let's plug this thing up and let's see what we can suck up. stuff I've been looking for. Hmm. Alright, this what little uh, I had um, vacuum up or whatever. We got a piece of uh, PVC pipe. Um, and then we also have some cigarette butts, a uh, wrapper of some sort. We got a little sawdust. Now, what I want to see I got some nuts and bolts. Yeah, I want to see if it can suck them nuts and bolts up. So let's go ahead and uh, let's do that right now. All right, so uh, here's our nuts bolts. We got a bolt like that size, that size, that size. We got a nut. Right, let's do it. that I had uh, chopped up um, and made some cloths out of. So let's see uh, what this thing here done. All right, what do we have? <laughs> well, we have the piece of plastic. <laughs> it sucked it up, but it just didn't, um, it just didn't go all the way through because you have this here that's blocking it off but yeah it sucked it up i say um pretty impressive all right so that's gonna wrap it up for this video i hope y'all enjoyed this video uh this right here is actually my very first time owning a shop bag um and i was also gonna mention or wanted to mention as well um that it's another port um that actually blows air out out the back of it if you would um, I want to say maybe if you wanted to uh, blow something off or whatever you could use that for blowing stuff off or around or say like if you have something like uh, in your uh, shop maybe some leaves or maybe uh, whatever you know you could just 
blow it on out. I want to thank y'all for watching, hanging out with me, and um, taking a look at this rigid vacuum cleaner. So, peace out, and I'll see y'all in the next video.